Hello, everybody. Welcome back. We know. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, hello. Wow, you're fast. I guess you are a wolf. Huh? Laying low. You don't look like I'm you're here. in stealth. Uh, but I guess you are. Hey. Okay. So, we just picked up. All right, then. Uh, what was your name? Sagani and her little wolf companion last time. Now let's finish exploring this area and move onward. It really hurt to dismiss Kana. It really did. I probably should dismiss dismissed off. Maybe I'll get Kana back here soon. I'm on the trail. Alright, so that just goes back up there. These more memorials. And, yep, they look to be. I gotta scour every inch of every map so that I know I can get as much money as I can, because, um. Ah, oh, and god, a forest lurker. I have not successfully brought one of these down yet. All right then. Oh jeez. Ready, watcher. Hey. Hmm? Okay. Uh, let's open up. Sure. <clears throat> yeah, forty-nine damage. You have sixteen pierce resistance. Oh. Hey. <laughs> uh. What is it? How may I help? That's okay. I'm here. That's okay. Is this piercing damage? Mm. All right, you may be going in melee here. Hmm. Oops. Indeed. All right. Can bust the heck out of that thing. Hmm. I'm here. Um, Wolf, go in. Eat. Right. Point the way. You go in. Thing isn't doing. Doing the job. Right. Yeah, I know. I know. You don't deal with it, there, buddy. Ready, watcher. Set him on fire. Yeah. What? Yeah. Huh. Gotcha that time. I'm here. Hmm? Hey. Of course. Well, now we know that they have a high piercing. Uh, Stormwall Gorge is now opened up, too. Hmm. Gosh, we still have a lot of map to cover, though. And I see a dead body right there. Keeping an eye out. What's, what's the full range of damage reduction that this thing has? Four burn. Hmm. Ooh. Okay. Well. Let's give you the flail. That's piercing, so let's switch you up to the slashing for this. Hey, right. of course. Huh? Right. Put your sneak attack damage on. <sighs> Boom, 54 damage. Very good. You're not getting. Point the way. Start moving. Start going. What is it? How may I help? Days. Through me. Mm -hmm. Blind. Huh? 
Got an arrow for this one. Yeah. I shall deal with this one. Got him. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Bring so it down. Much for you. Huh? Cool. All right then. Of wizards double. Let's actually put some of these in his quick slots, I guess. Uh, take out the stew. Keep the grimoire there. Jolting touch. Minus 10 deflection, minus 10 reflex. Sure, we'll just put that in there. Let me start using these dang things. Hey. All right then. I'll take a look. Okay, looks like something's up here. Keeping an eye out. Maybe. There we go. Okay. Just a abandoned cart. Hey, all right. Ooh. I'm on the trail. It's another forest lurker. Huh? Yeah, it is. Okay. Huh? <clears throat> that one was not as much damage. I'm here. Uh, yes. I. Mm -hmm. So much for you. Fight. Got him. Fire bless this. Huh? Oh, I haven't even been using your. I see she would with fleeing prey. The hunter aims for a spot that would slow the target enemy progress. All right, so hoblils and does raw damage. Marks prey. Oh, that's what he did, isn't it? <laughs> well, it's too late to mark the prey, but oh well. And what does the flame reveal? I don't know, Durance. Of course. He won't see me coming. Doesn't appear to be too many secrets on this map. Just a bunch of these forest quiet. lurkers. Laying low. Mm-hmm. What? No, we don't hey, you. Of course. What is it? I'll take care of it. <clears throat> I'm here. There we go. Try to knock him down. Yes. Days. Sure. <coughs> yeah. Whoop, switch to this. And yeah. I forgot to mark, so. Mark. Ouch. When you get back up, kick him in the face. 
Oh no. He's already dead. Hmm? Hey. Alright, there's the other one. Alright, so this map's clear. Basically. Now where the heck are we going though? That's the thing. So we gotta go to Defiance Bay for this. Wait, go to the Temple of Wodica. Okay, so now that, that isn't Defiance Bay. Do we have anything else? Travel to the Cliffs of Soul and the Vision. Top, top cliffs overlooking the water. So we gotta find a place where we could also find cliffs. Maybe a stone wall, storm wall gorge. Maybe. That looks cliffy. And rainy. A druid. Okay. Hey. Huh? Um. Get that back. Yes. Hmm. Hmm. Switch to that. I'm here. Switch to your bow. I saw hey. the graphical glitch of the pole arm, which is weird. Huh? Sure. Oh, jeez. Well, they found me quick. Uh -oh. Attack him. Mm. Um, attack. Hmm? Huh? Pray. And attack. Maybe hobble it too. Alright, attack him. Hi. Now, daze these people. Hey. Knock down the druid. What? Blast him. <laughs> Holy hmm? shit! How may I help? <laughs> I shot. Holy crap! Moe. Um. Man, I can't even see what the hell's going on behind these trees. But apparently, Durin's just got I... killed. I guess. Barrel uh. Druid. Man, you just took a lot of damage to- what the hell is going on? Oh, we're like in a blizzard? Is that the thing is going on? The job. What is it? Huh? Man, I really wish I knew what the hell's going on. The wolf is down. How may I help? Well, this thing is doing its job. Yes. Uh. Ouch. Hmm? Huh? Druids, holy crap. Double fine battle axe, fine flails, a fine spear, fine hide armor.
Hmm. Youch. Okay. Well, you actually have fine hide armor. Let's have you wear that. Why don't you be able to act faster? I'm, even though I know this is really good, but that's second chance. Ah, it's only. 10% more recovery time. It's not that crazy. This hide armor seems pretty good, though. Hey. Okay. So, what's everyone to hit pull at? 282? 84? Hey. Keep you guys out of the fight. Hey, of course. Margarine's fire casts light in dark places. Man, that was insane. They won't see me coming. Hmm. Hmm. Another one of those things. Okay. They have pretty good sight. Ready, watcher. Yes. Of course. Hmm? Bye. Move back, move back. Point the way. Hmm? Mm hmm? <clears throat> there we go. Alright. And engage her. Point the way. Mark that target. Attack. Well. Daze them. He isn't doing the job. Still alive. I need something sharp. Point the way. After and eat him up. Hmm. Hi. I shot. These are for a while. Can trust me. If we've to go down, no good. Jeez. Let's burn this away. What is it? Hey. Feels like I've been tossed around in a snowstorm. <sighs> <laughs> All right then. Oh boy. Yes. All right, so we leveled up. That's cool. Athletic survival. Five burn damage per wound. Wait, the monk is able to channel physical pain into pure energy and redirect it at his or her attackers. While the muck has wounds, he or she adds proportional fire damage. Oh. Move speed. Two-point counter. We can stun. That could be useful. Two per rest. Is he able to cleanse his or her body, reducing the duration of incoming effects? Requires two wounds. Target is pushed, then goes to prone. Calls upon the power of the monk's psyche, reflecting half of ranged missile targeting. Only the monk back... Wait. Targeting only the monk back to their point of origin. Only attacks resulting in a miss have a chance to be reflected. Maybe turning the... Ah, uh, stunning blow. Hmm? Huh? And I guess we should camp. Sagani draws up beside you, her fox following at her heels, and takes a seat next to you. Even if you are putting one over on me, it's nice to have a hunting party again. Finding this Persook must be important for you to have traveled so long. Five years for me. 
Must be 30-something for Ichimok. Wow. How's the search it's going? It's been a long hunt. A long time away from my family. Before, I'd crossed the tundra of Nasitok following caribou herds. I didn't want to leave Kalu and our children, but I was eager to visit lands my people rarely do. But five years without finding him. It's like two hours of necking. I'm ready to be done with it. So why do you have to find him? Soul recovery is an old village tradition. We call it the Tarnak Elite Sock. Once in a generation, we seek the soul of a much respected and long dead village elder. We tell him what's changed in the village, how people remember him. The only other Tarnak Elite Sock during my lifetime happened when I was a girl, not long after Persok died. We feasted on blubber and fermented milk for a week, and we honored the chosen huntress as a hero. Then she left, and we returned to our duties. We still sang her name to the skies during festival season, but we otherwise didn't speak of her. Hmm. What happened to her? I don't think she ever returned. It happens that way sometimes. She folds her arms and her expression sober. Hmm. I don't think that's a little too soft for my character to say. But maybe that. People often forget. Well, well. Yeah, sure. I think of that frequently. It's not being forgotten by my village that troubles me. But sometimes I wonder how my husband and children remember me. If they think of me often. Hmm. Returning to them is what matters. Both practical and true. Still, there's no point in dwelling on it. More often, I find myself wondering whether Persok will remember us. You claim to see souls. What do you think? Do you remember your past lives? Hmm. In fragments? What's that like? Feels like I'm going crazy most of the time. I don't envy you. Guess I'm lucky I only have to worry about someone else's past life. Makes me wonder what Persak remembers about our village. Or if a turn at the wheel has yanked the details out of his mind like it does for most of us. What would you tell him about your village? Masuk is probably much the same as it was a hundred years ago. We live between tundra and frozen forests, and the land takes as much as it gives. But our hardships bring us together. And the elders truly unite us. They keep the stories of past generations, and they guide us from season to season, through good years and lean. Uh, brushes against her hip, and she scratches his head. Recently, there have been a lot of good years. My aunts say we've had fewer clashes with neighboring villages thanks to the hunting territories that per Persak helped establish. In bad years, we rely on trade with the merchants that pass our shores. We exchange walrus tusks and seal pelts for grains that last us the hard winters. Persok brokered a lot of those agreements too. She holds up a bear figurine. He got this from one of the Amawa ships that used to trade with us. Sounds like he did a lot for your people. That's what I'm supposed to remind him. Sounds like you're on a hunt of your own though. You feeling the thrill of the chase or ready for this to be over? Every day brings something new. I enjoy the adventure. Refreshing indeed. She rises and stretches, looking around. Might as well keep moving while we've got some daylight. Sure. Let's go. And that's going to do it for this episode, everybody. I will see you all in the next one. Take care.